You've never left Canada? Oh, Scarlet, you're in for a treat. You are in for a treat. Oh, thank goodness that was only twice. Woo! What's on your bucket list, Scarlet? Where do you want to go first? 13 missed calls. Nice. There is no escape. It's only a matter of time before you're within my grasp. <laughs> is he using one of those voice mods? I don't know. That can't be his real voice, right? Someone stashed something here, but apparently these bugs took over. Ew, gross. Oh no, my phone! <laughs> my phone! How? Why? What has the world come to? I. It's a paperweight at this point? Damn. Your phone gets fried. What do you do? Go. Tell me all about it, chat. Tell me about your nightmares if your phone gets fried. What's the first thing you cry for? <laughs> That's my car. They must have brought it here. Ooh, speaking of snow. This could be a hiding place, but it's too dark to see inside. What an ornate shield. Sturdy, too. Hmm. Locked. My key should be around here somewhere. I mean, we've been here a while if our car is snowed in like that. Okay, I've got some crackers. Doorbell. Gotcha. A regular size pool? You can get one of those kitty pools, lizard. You should get one of those kitty ones. Those are great. Probably some pictures and files. That's what you would lose off your phone. What kind of pictures? Don't answer that. Ooh. British pounds. Oh, we're in for another treat of a puzzle. What's with the freaky looking half mask there? Oh my goodness. Salem, Massachusetts. Pierre Lachaise Cemetery in Paris, France. Italy. Oh, those are some good places. I once thought I'd be fine to charge phone a few minutes during a thunderstorm. It was not. The God zapped. Oh no. Oh no. The catacombs in Paris. Yes, that's where they like dug up the cemeteries and buried all the skeletons, right? I think I saw, like, they have these markers, too, that you can check out in Paris. Paris old, right? Paris is, like, Viking old. Yeah. Gibbs, I could tell you what kind, but... So you're basically, you've got some butt picks, some peach picks in yours, JJ? That's fine, to each your own. Hmm. It's full of skeletons? Oh boy. Okay, let's see. So I've got myself some bug repellent. Let's go and... Where the hell are those bugs? Oh, here we go. Nice. I would love to see the catacombs someday. Yes, me too. The door needs a knob. It sure does. Cassium, how are you doing? Welcome in. Welcome, welcome. So I've got a doorbell. I don't think this counts there. Oh, it does. Oh, that was a handle. Never mind. <laughs> OMG, did that really happen? Did that really- oh my god, the epic stores. Alright, we got some glitter. It's time to get cracking. 
No phone, no music, or games for the road? Nope. The knob got handsy? It sure did. I did not consent, Alana. I did not consent. Uh, let's give the cherub its wings back. Mm-hmm. That was a good mini jump scare. It sure was. What room is this? Why is there a rope in the bedroom? Don't answer that question. That was rhetorical. This room reminds you of Phantasmid 5. Well, they're def definitely gatekeeping on the clicking here. I should be able to click quicker, faster, you know? Mm-hmm. Well, so you can practice tying knots. You gotta practice tying your knots, you know? Like a good uh, Girl Scout, you need to be able to do your knots. Okay, what exactly, I mean, it, I, is this a boat or a hat? Because that's a hat. So maybe it's a boat. It's a paper boat? So many clowns? I mean, is there really enough clowns? What am I supposed to do? Count the hairs on my head? I have pics of gives on my phone. LOL. Wait, the pics? Or... Oh, wow. Okay. Gotcha. Thank you, Shinny. Find all the morphing objects. <laughs> Let's see, what else is morphing? What's with this puppet? That's weird. <laughs> oh, there you go. Gotcha. So we got two more to go. Yep, got the ball. What else, what else, what else? Mm hmm. Nope, not that. Oh, the rope! Oh, it's a skipping rope. You guys, it's a skipping rope. Oh, we get to do this again? This must be a kid's room, right? I'm guessing. Maybe. Okay, so what is this? Baseball glove? I'm assuming this is a moth, maybe? Oh, there it is. Gotcha! Oh, okay, I thought we were done. Are we gonna get a diamond ring? Oh, I want the diamond ring that was in the mouth. Crackers and matches. Let's light it up, up, up. Oh, this is lovely. Hey, my keys, how did they end up here? That's, that's the question, not why there's a little puppet that's got like rope around its neck? Oh. Why? Weird. Okay, that's not how doors, modern doors work. That was old school. The car doesn't look too bad. Let's see if it works and let's get the flock out of here. I can't get a good grip on the key with my bare hands. I can't grip it with my bare hands. 
Hmm. I'd step away to make a plate of food. Ooh, what did you? What are you sharing with us, Tara? What are you sharing? If you recall from Phantasm 5, you might see this one completely familiar. Broken Jack, you say? The Jack is useless without something to crank it. Mouth. Uh, where does that my mouth go? I need to find a place for my mouth. Hmm. Torn photo and some crackers. I'm assuming there's going to be a bird. Other, otherwise, why the hell do we have crackers? That's it? That just gets me into the... Hmm. Let's see, let's see. That's the lobby. Wait, we have a map. How is our map looking? Okay, it's starting to take some shape. Looks like we gotta go back to the car. Yes. Oh, that's where the mouth goes. Here's my mouth. That is so weird. Why would they put a mouth there? Yeah, Shitty, it was. You're correct. Yeah, I'm not sure if it's a parrot or rat, but somebody's getting these crackers. Thank you, Liam. I feel like this, you know, by very definition, utility knife would be of great utility right now. Although the whistle's probably going to be good, too. Man, she needs to tidy up her glove compartment. All right, chat, let's be honest with ourselves. How many of you, show of hands, have a glove compartment this messy? It's okay, it's a safe space. No one's judging. Pearl earrings? Is this an avocado? What is this thing? Oh, it's a pear. Oh, okay, gotcha. Me? <laughs> Not me, I don't drive. Oh, there you go. I got a junk drawer if that counts? Sure. It can be in your house or it can be in your car, but do you have a drawer just like this? I already feel judged. <laughs> no, but do you have a junk drawer though? Well, it's got like a bunch of stuff like this in it. No, I'm not judging at all. I'm just asking questions, open-ended questions. Okay, let's see what we got here. Interesting. What? Eyelash curler? Hang on. Do these work? Like, I've seen, my mother had one of these things, but I never really knew what it was. <laughs> An eyelash curler. Is that for real? If you're going on a date and your person you're with opens up your glove compartment and sees that, are they like gone or are they sticking around i don't know that's what i'm asking that's all i'm asking I'm asking some simple questions <laughs> wow look at this guy oh my leaving so soon not in your condition. Why don't you return to your room? A hot meal is waiting for you. Compliments of the hotel. Uh, bro, I think I'm good. Thanks for your free cookies or cocoa or whatever it is. I love that the eyelash curler started the engine. I don't think I've ever done that before. That's awesome. Unfortunately, I bear bad news. You cannot leave the hotel. Uh, excuse me? What are you trying to say? I'm afraid your car battery has died. Edgar will repair it straight away, won't you, Edgar? I could just walk. What do I need my car for? Uh, yep. <laughs> what the hell? What's with these dudes? What's with the stereotypes? 
The butler did it, or the janitor repair bro did it? Edgar is our handyman. He's a handyman. man of few words, but he gets the job done. Your battery is in good hands. Madam, I just received a call from your sister. She'll be here shortly. Why don't you wait for her in your room? That's a total lie. <laughs> There's no way that he received a call from our sister. Our sister is somewhere in this godforsaken hotel, tied up to a bed or something, or a pipe or something. She did not go get groceries. There's no way. You like the glasses? That was pretty classic, yeah. Yes. Very convincing. Tilly's coming back? Maybe I was being a little paranoid. No, no. It's called fear driving the sense of flight or fight. Pick something, right? Time to book it, exactly. This is like the definition of stranger danger. Nobody's sticking around for stranger danger. Okay, so I guess we're just gonna go back inside like nothing's weird about this whole situation. I think this is uh, where we're gonna have to jack it up. The evil Gomez is scaring the poop out of me. <laughs> I fully agree with that. The board is useless without the centerpiece. I guess we're going back into our bedroom. Imagine if Lily was here and she she was shows up here. You're like, whoa, the bicycle's moved. It was over here before. Or oh, hello. <laughs> hey, we got a buddy here. Is he a happy one or a mad one? <laughs> well, that answers my question. Damn, bro. He's angry. You want some crackers? Now are you angry? This looks very similar to the one in my dream. Cola or Pepsi? What are you asking, gamer? <laughs> Why are we saying cola or Pepsi? I'm a little afraid to find out. I love the angler fish. These are cool. Somber Hills Hotel was established almost 200 years ago. We started as small as sheep herders until we accidentally struck oil. Really? We first built a hotel. We were rich. But soon enough, strange things started happening. The oil dried out. The sheep fell to the wolves. We had several fires. Dr. Pepper. Dr. Pepper is good. Ratatouille. That means struck oil. I'm assuming they like dug oil in the backyard or whatever. Several fires. Gotcha. Oh, I thought I was done. Now I gotcha. Oh, okay, never mind. Is this the queen or a queen? Helpful sign. I'd better take this with me. Yay! Yay, yay, yay! Did that painting just move? 
Oh my goodness. Wait. What is that noise? Welcome in, Jules. How are you doing tonight? 